Hello, my name is Brandon, and welcome to Retro Reactions, a place where I experience amazing music from the 70s, 80s, and 90s for the very first time. And today we're going to be traveling all the way back to 1970 to listen to Dusk by Genesis. Yes, we're almost done with the album. Really excited for this one, and of course, the final song, The Knife, as well. Big song. You guys have told me it's amazing. It's heavy. It's a live favorite. But I'm sure I'm going to love Dusk based on what I read. Uh, by the way, I have heard Stagnation. I'll link that video on my end screen at the end of this video. Uh, so excited again. Let's get right into it. It comes from Trespass, of course, their second studio album. Lyrics are by Anthony Phillips, and the music is by Phillips and Mike Rutherford. The song touches on themes of love, change, loss, and the passage of time. Anyway, if you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe and like button, as well as the notification bell to join the Retro Reactions community, where it's all amazing music all the time. And a reminder to check out my Patreon page with exclusive reactions not found here on YouTube, no time era restrictions, and one full album reaction every month. Link is in the description below. All right, here we go. <laughs>
wow, that part, you know what I'm talking about, one of my favorite parts of the song. That's a perfect example of a dark touch that you can add to a gentle, beautiful song. You know, I was so worried because I had a feeling I was going to love this one, but I saw the time. It was just over four minutes. I was afraid I was going to be disappointed that I would want it to go on for longer, but no, it was perfect the way it was because they pack so much pure, gentle beauty, so much sonic goodness in this short amount of time. Wow, just loved it. As I always say with Genesis, much to love here, and I was completely lost in its beauty, pure, gentle beauty. Wow. Once again, I was gently washed over by those beautiful acoustic guitars, those 12-string acoustic guitars, just pure heaven and bliss. Wow. And then Peter comes in the mix with his soft vocal tone. Yes, he did get big at moments, but I love the pocket, the lane he's in when he's soft emotional and expressive, matched perfectly with this music. Based on the title, I had a feeling it was going to be a slow, soft ballad, especially knowing that Anthony wrote it. Uh, boy, was that correct, you know. Just enjoyed every second of it. Obviously, it got me emotional. Um, the backing vocals were interesting. They sounded beautiful, but I like how they were kind of washed out, a bit muffled. It just added to the dreamy feel of the song. Very dreamy, very beautiful. Uh, then we get the flute to top it off. Peter's flute, amazing. It was kind of playful and solemn at the same time. You wouldn't normally put those two together. Again, very fitting for the song. There was this really cool flute moment. I don't remember how it went, but it got dark for just a second there. It came later after the main solo. Um, anyway, I'll go back and hear it. You already know, but just amazing. So much happening here even though it was calm and gentle, serene. I'm not sure if they built up more harmonies towards the end of the song, but that's when I really noticed these lovely harmonies by the other gentlemen. Just incredible, you know. And then such a creative ending. The guitar moves to the right channel only. I was surprised by that. And then these deep piano notes on the left. I think there was just two of them to end the song. Looks like we go straight into the knife. Just perfection. Many reasons just right here in these four minutes as to why Trespass is such a groundbreaking, amazing album and a great shift in the band's direction, which would lead to decades of greatness. And as I usually think, when I hear amazing songs, I wonder if this was performed live. You know, I looked on YouTube and I don't think I could find any live performances. So I'm a bit saddened, a bit worried that maybe they never played this on tour. If you guys know, you can let me know. But if not, we have this beautiful original version to love forever. Stunning, beautiful, captivating, soul enriching, gorgeous, calming, etc. All the words all the adjectives that I often use for Genesis. Completely love this one. It's getting an easy Epic Platinum Record Award. Yes, so deserving for Dusk by Genesis 1970. And thank you so much for gracing my ears today with this gorgeous work of art. Peter Gabriel, Tony Banks, Mike Rutherford, Anthony Phillips, and John Mayhew. All right, that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment down below. If you wish to chat about this song, I would love to know what you think about it, if you find it as gorgeous and touching as I did. Anyway, you take care, stay safe, stay hydrated, and remember to let peace, calm, and light into your day and night. And I'll see you next time in the past. Oh, 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 oh.